What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Star Wars Battlefront 2. Today I want to bring you some quick news that's kind of out about the game for the upcoming May update and also some things that are going on in game right now. In case you did not know, there is a Princess Leia skin event going on in game as of right now. It started yesterday, May the 1st, and it runs through May the 6th. It is a group kind of community challenge, so it's not something you have to do individually. Um, now, this event will end, like I said, on the 6th, and DICE said they're not going to be selling this skin in the near future for currency or, you know, real money or anything like that. So, make sure that you log in between now and the 6th and claim your skin once this challenge is complete. Now, there have been some things kind of talked about of what's going to happen with the May uh, update. And of course, we're not quite sure on a date on the, or anything on that yet, but with the May update, there will be a new capital supremacy map and some changes to heroes versus villains heroes versus villains is more of a target style system now i don't know if you've ever played it before if you haven't i'll kind of give you the rundown of how it works of course you know you're a hero or you're a villain and you have a particular hero or villain that you're going after the other heroes or villains that you fight while you're going after that does not really count towards anything now they're making this to more of a team deathmatch style where every encounter that you get in with a hero or a villain will count towards score. So that's going to be the changes to heroes versus villains and also some changes to uh, some heroes in game. That is Yoda and Han Solo. Now these are the only two they mentioned. There may be some more later of some different things going on. But as of right now, we know Yoda and Han Solo are getting two things back that have been taken away. First of all, Han Solo, the shoulder charge will now stagger blocking enemies and Yoda the dash will again go through blocks. So these are two things that have been taken out of the game that will be added back in. That will kind of give you a different way to play or kind of go back to your older way or older system of playing these. Because trying to fight against blocking enemies can, can kind of be a pain, especially if it's a hero or a villain. So being able to kind of throw these other characters that you're fighting against off balance if they're blocking is a good plus in my mind. So I'm glad they're bringing these back to the game. Hope you guys are enjoying the Star Wars Battlefront 2 content. If you did not see my video yesterday kind of showcasing the game and talking about how it's on the comeback and it's becoming a very popular game again, definitely check that video out. Of course, I will be bringing you a good bit of Star Wars Battlefront 2 uh, videos here on the channel along with the, all the other videos I do for other games. So I hope you guys are enjoying all the different variety of content on the channel as of right now. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Of course, if you liked it, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.